New at 11 tonight, a local business that's been around for generations is sold. Bliss Brothers of Attleboro has offered their ice cream across the region now for over 90 years. But as we've learned, the business will no longer be family owned and operated. New at 11 tonight, Eyewitness News caught up with a woman who's been working for Bliss Brothers for decades and one person who's been eating their ice cream now for almost 80 years. And as Eyewitness News reporter Shantae Lance tells us, the popular ice cream isn't going very far. That's right, Mike and Shannon. Many sh are sharing their stories and ties to the Bliss Brothers Dairy Parlor. This after hearing word that their beloved Attleboro shop has been sold. The sunset over this landmark Attleboro restaurant marks the end of an era. I, cry I cried. <laughs> like many other Southern New Englanders, Lou Ann Clark spent most of her life inside these walls. Bliss Brothers Dairy Parlor has been owned and managed by the same family for nearly a century. Owner and President David Bliss confirmed to Eyewitness News that he sold his company to New England Ice Cream Corporation, a large Taunton-based ice cream distributor. The owners chose to sell because they say their family is too busy with other pursuits. Too emotional, they declined to talk on camera, but gave permission to employees. It's been fun. I've met a lot of people. Including her own husband, working for Bliss Brothers more than four decades ago. I met him in 74, and all my children have worked here. A food fixture embedded in family traditions. I grew up with Bliss Brothers. Dolores Bubia was born one year after the dairy parlor opened back in 1929. Everybody has to retire sooner or later, and, but I hope the standards are as high as Bliss are. I'll be very disappointed if they're not. And if that's the case, they won't see me. <laughs> I hope that the new company will continue on as the Blisses have. It's a, it's a wonderful family, and they're going to be missed. And that employee says she was told by the owners that even though the ownership is changing, the way the business is run will remain the same. Shante Lands, Eyewitness News.